What is up, everyone? Andy with the Heartland Institute, bringing you more from climaterealism.com. So it's 2021, and we can finally cancel one of the alarmist arguments. Welcome to the party, climate alarmists. Us here on our side have been getting canceled for years. I mean, the first parlor was just kicked off the entire internet. It was removed from all the app stores. Amazon Web Services fully removed it. I mean, yeah, our side's been dealing with this for years, but welcome to the party. Also, interesting sidebar here, but I'm most of my friends are left-leaning, and they all say that the right-wing are the ones that are engaging in cancel culture. I don't know those of you that watch this video is if you agree with them, but I think that's crazy. But the argument we're going to talk about today is that of Antarctica, that it's been getting warmer and warmer and all the sea ice is melting. Time to end that argument. So the study we're about to talk about comes from one of the most prominent science journals in the world. It destroys, cancels, the claim that Antarctica is warming and that the ice sheet is melting. Actually, Antarctica hasn't warmed in the last 70 years and the ice sheet is actually expanding. Writing in the journal Nature, scientists at Columbia University and the University of Victoria, British Columbia report, the Antarctic continent has not warmed in the last seven decades, despite a monotonic increase in the atmospheric concentration of greenhouse gases. The scientists also observed that over the past several decades, Antarctic sea ice has modestly expanded. So this chart shows how temperatures have changed during the past 30 years compared to temperatures recorded between 1950 and 1980. Clearly, the vast majority of Antarctica is cooling, with warming occurring over just a small portion of the continent that juts out into the southern ocean. The legend on the bottom shows that warming versus cooling is color-coded. Now, the majority of Antarctica is cooling. There are small pockets of warming, as I just mentioned, but the overarching trend is that of cooling. So you can forget the claims that Antarctica is warming and that the ice sheet is melting beyond control. They're simply not true. Antarctica overall has not warmed in the past 70 years and the ice sheet has actually modestly expanded. So thank you. We can now welcome the alarmists into cancel culture. Welcome to the party. It's Andy with the Heartland Institute. Make sure you follow us. Check us out on Facebook. If you're watching this on YouTube, we got a Facebook page. It's very active. People are chatting there all the time. I'd love to see your comments. If you're watching this on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube. Like, retweet, follow. Do, do all the social media stuff. You've heard it before. Peace.